Hello and welcome. Today we are at Legoland Billund and we're going to take a look around the Ninjago section for their what was their brick or treat event. Now in the pumpkins let me know all of the different characters that you can spot. List them off in the comments below. As we go around it's just a very short sharp sweet video. You can see it's literally just over five minutes long so we're going to have a look at all the new additions that they've added in for their brick or treat event which I now know has passed. But you can see just here where you've got the Fanta artwork to the left hand side. That was part of their brickle treat and it was a very good thing because they had one of these dotted in every single land. The little ones were running around trying to collect all of the drinks and the sweets and everything with their sort of spooky bag that they got given. And it was just a really nice atmosphere because it kept the queue lines clear, it kept all of these clear. Nobody really bottlenecked up throughout the whole day and it just had a really nice atmosphere. But if you do want to see more in-depth video of this land, Go to the Legoland Billund playlist and we'll have a look at all of the other rides and things that are available in there. The queue line, the shop and everything like that. As we walk around, we will have a look at all of the different theming that they've added. And I will also explain to you, if you are new to the channel, obviously then welcome. But if you are new to the channel, I'll explain to you what is in within this section. Because it has got a very, very big frontage. So as you come in and walk through underneath the Ninjago sign, you have all the different Ninjago characters. There's plenty of places to sit down on like the picnic tables and the walls and things like that. Lots and lots of different photo opportunities. There is a meet and greet for the different characters up here. That is the building that you can see just to the left. That is where they will stand and obviously you can get your photo taken with them. You have a Ninjago shop where it just purely sells Ninjago Lego and that is how they get you when you come off the queue of the ride down the exit and then you come through into the shop. The queue line to the ride is really really good because if you can just get on there and there's nobody in front of you it then gives you actually lots of opportunities to get loads of photos. If it is very very busy there are multiple places where the little ones and the big ones alike can sort of get out the queue to build to then rejoin and there's just other lots of games and activities to play. Now we're not going to be looking at those in this video because like I said it's only five minutes long but we are just going to have a quick wander around and just see what is available, what is different. So that is where the character meet and greet is. They, I did actually see one of them walking around, it was either in this video or it was at the start of the day. It's been a while since this was filmed. I've done quite a bit since, but I do like what they've done with all the pumpkins. I think it's done very, very well. And obviously the pumpkins still look very fresh. So it's just a really nice, pretty area with all the sort of the plantation, everything that they've added. Now don't worry, that is not a child on the floor. That is actually a massive teddy bear that they won from the pay to play that was just on the right hand side. The small green building that was directly in front before we went to this Lego model. I think that used to be a eatery, but that hasn't been open for a good while. So it'd be interesting to see what they do do with that, if they do anything with it for the 2023 season, because I can't remember it being open over at all in the 2022. And if you can remember what it used to be with regards to what it used to serve, it might have been like a noodle outlet or something like that, maybe. And obviously, please do let me know in the comments below because, um, like I said, this is not my not my local park, even though I am starting to come here more than Legoland Windsor. Now, as we come back and coming back through, we're now coming through the other entrance slash exit. You can see that they've actually opened this bit up because that looks like where they get a lot of the bits and pieces in and out of the park. And I think that's why that was a slightly, slightly different colour green, so I'm sure that bit is actually covered over normally. We then out the 4D cinema, which is directly behind me, is where you can then get your spooky burger. All of that is available in a completely different playlist. You can see just the vast amount of bits and pieces that you've got out the front. And if you pay attention, just the bottom left or the far left now, shall I say, there is another one of those little shacks where you can go and get yourself some treats and little, little snacks and things all as part of their Halloween event. You did have to pay a little bit extra to take part in it but you did get a good goodie bag and a map you can run around and people are just trying to spell bits and pieces because there was there was a word to spell throughout the whole park not just within the miniland and it just kept the children entertained throughout the whole day now i said it was a super short sweet video it's now under five minutes so i've actually cut a little bit off but that's it, I'm going to be done and finished. But if you can like, subscribe and all that good stuff, that'd be absolutely fantastic. Hopefully you've enjoyed this super short, sweet tour of the, the, the Njago land at Legoland Billen. But like I said, there is a very good, two very good rides, Laser Maze and The Ride. And there's a really nice shop to have a look at. Then you've got all the speed and reaction walls, lots of different rock climbing walls and all the different things are available within this section of the park. But that is it, I'm done. So guys, as always, thank you very much for watching. You guys take care and catch you in the next one. Ta-da.